What comes into your mind when you hear the word celebrity? Is it fame, fortune, prestige, glitz and glamour, or the chiseled features that make them seem like Greek gods? The list goes on and on, but collectively speaking, I think we can all agree that we somehow link celebrities with perfection. There's just something about them that draws us to them and makes us want to see them and be like them. Fortunately for us, keeping up with our favorite celebrities couldn't be any easier. Not to mention it couldn't be any easier to even follow and adapt to their lifestyle. You could just head over to Google, or if you're a member of the Gen Z, Instagram, and you already see what their latest haircut is, what their new wardrobe looks like, what books they're currently into, or what exactly is their health and fitness routine that makes them age like Benjamin Button and stay in tip top shape, which is exactly what we're going to be covering in today's video. Before we introduce the six stars who practice intermittent fasting, let's first talk about the real celebrity of the show, which is intermittent fasting, because really, what is intermittent fasting in the first place? Intermittent fasting is essentially a pattern of eating where you cycle between fasting and eating on a certain schedule. It is not a diet per se, because people who follow intermittent fasting are restricted from eating anything they want during their eating window. Intermittent fasting mainly focuses on when you eat instead of what you eat. There are different ways on how you can approach intermittent fasting and you can definitely tailor it according to your lifestyle. Six of the most popular ways of doing intermittent fasting are the following. The 16-8 method, the 5-2 method, alternate day fasting, eat stop eat diet, the 14-10 method, and the warrior diet. We know that's a lot, but don't worry because we'll only be focusing on the methods of this video celebrities. Now, the reason why everybody is crazy about intermittent fasting is because studies have shown that they offer a plethora of benefits which include, but are not limited to, weight loss, a simpler lifestyle, insulin resistance, improved heart and brain health, possible prevention against cancer, and even anti-aging benefits, a true blockbuster indeed. For example, a study conducted last 2014 has shown that participants who followed intermittent fasting lost 3 to 8% of their weight in a span of 3 to 24 weeks, and they've lost 4 to 7% of their waist circumference, both of which are noteworthy results when compared to most weight loss tactics and studies. Aside from that, a study conducted on 2011 has shown that doing intermittent fasting won't greatly affect muscle loss, which is good news for people who want to tone up, lose fat, and build muscle, or for people who don't want to lose a lot of muscle that they've already earned. As for its health benefits, researchers have shown that intermittent fasting aids in the improvement of neurological and cardiovascular health. According to one study, intermittent fasting induces BDNF or brain-derived neurotropic factor expression, which is a hormone that promotes the growth of new neurons by playing a role in their growth, maturation, and differentiation. As for your heart health, intermittent fasting has been found to reduce low-density lipoprotein or bad cholesterol, reduce blood triglycerides, inflammatory markers, and improve insulin resistance and regulate blood sugar levels. Now with that out of the way, let's get into the different celebrities that do intermittent fasting. Number 1. Benedict Cumberbatch Whether you know him as Sherlock Holmes or Doctor Strange, it's no mystery why Mr. Cumberbatch isn't a stranger to intermittent fasting, pun intended. It has been reported that the Marvel superhero followed the 5-2 diet where he only consumed about 500 calories or less for 2 days a week. This allowed the actor to stay in shape and keep up with the physical demands of his role. The 5-2 method works by fasting for 2 whole days and eating regularly during the 5 remaining days. During these fasting days, you are only permitted to consume 500-600 to 600 calories per day. Your two fasting days are totally up to you and you can adjust them according to what fits your schedule. Just keep in mind that you should have at least one non-fasting day between them so as not to go overboard and deprive your body. Next on the list we have is Tom Hardy who plays the merciless terrorist Bane in the movie Dark Knight Rises as well as the comedic symbiote creature known as Venom. Aside from eating 6 meals a day, Mr. Hardy also has been reported to do intermittent fasting to help himself build muscle and bulk up for his role, which if you've seen The Dark Knight Rises, you'll see that it certainly paid off. Number 3 on the list is Australia's golden girl, Nicole Kidman. The actress is reported to practice the 16-8 intermittent fasting method, one of the most common and arguably one of the easiest ways of performing the said diet. The actress does the 16-8 method by having their first meal at around 10am and then having her last meal before 6pm. If you're interested in doing the said diet, you could definitely adjust your feeding window according to what best suits you. For example, if you're not really a morning person or if you're always on the go during the morning and you don't really have the time to whip up a meal, you could do the 16-8 method by skipping breakfast and start eating at around 12pm instead and have your last meal by 8pm. The flexibility that this method allows definitely makes this regimen easier to stick with in the long run. The bottom line is, you have to have an 8 hour feeding window and a 16 hour fasting window. Number 4. Christian Bale 
Whether you know him from American Psycho, Empire of the Sun, or the Batman trilogy, there is no doubt that this bonafide actor goes above and beyond when it comes to performing his roles, which we can see by his dedication to losing or gaining weight in order to fully portray his character. One of the ways the A-list Hollywood actor is able to do so is by doing one meal a day or OMAD, one of the many variations of intermittent fasting. This restricts users to only one meal a day, where users fast for 23 hours and they consume all of their calories for one day in one single meal. It is important to note though that this isn't the healthiest way to approach weight loss because the OMAD method can be too restrictive. If you ever plan on doing this, limit the OMAD technique for only one day during the week and remember to consume nutrient-dense foods in order for your body to be able to function well. It is also important to note that because of this diet's extremely restrictive quality, this should only be done for a short period of time. Next up on our list as number 5 is another A-lister celebrity, Ben Affleck. The American actor is known for many roles, but is recently known for taking on the role as the dark and brooding billionaire Bruce Wayne, otherwise known as Batman, in the Justice League movie and in the Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice. The actor reportedly got in shape for his role as Batman by doing intermittent fasting combined with a rigorous training regimen and a healthy and balanced diet. And last but certainly not least at number 6 is the iconic Jennifer Lopez. Even at 53 years old, JLo only continues to look better year by year. Talk about aging like fine wine. Looking the way she does is no easy feat. A lot of hard work is definitely being done in order to look and feel healthy like she does, but it surely isn't impossible. And you guessed it. One of the ways JLo achieves this is by doing intermittent fasting. She typically does fasted cardio where she does cardio before having breakfast and after the unintentional fasting that our body undergoes while we sleep. Doing fasted cardio is said to be amazing in losing weight because doing so will burn your fat reserves instead of the food that you consumed if you were to eat a meal before a workout. Now that we've gone through our whole list, we'd like to share a few tips on how you can make intermittent fasting work for you. These tips aren't rocket science and most of them are already pretty obvious, but hey, we all need reminders every once in a while. Firstly, remember to eat wholesome, nutritious foods. We mentioned earlier that when it comes to intermittent fasting, users aren't really restricted on what foods they should be eating during their eating window. But if you think about it, if you really want to improve your overall health and achieve your goals holistically, you wouldn't gorge on a cheeseburger with fries on the side and a huge cup of soda with a hefty slice of rich chocolate cake for dessert and expect to see results, right? Yes, you may still lose weight, but you'll also subject yourself to the risk of developing type 2 diabetes, hypertension, and all that, which is surely not what we're aiming for. Bottom line, eat healthy. Second, stay consistently active. Achieving a healthy weight can be achieved by regulating your food intake, but you can also amplify and see a better results when you constantly move your body. There is no one size fits all when it comes to physical activity, so just choose something that you love to do. It can be taking your dog out for a walk, going out for a run, cycling, going for a swim, pilates, yoga, high intensity interval training, or resistance training. It's all up to you and what works for you. And lastly, go easy on yourself. If you're a beginner who decides to do the 16-8 method of intermittent fasting, you might feel overwhelmed and discouraged if you fail to hit the 16-hour fasting mark and end up snacking on the last hour because you felt extremely weak and hungry. Take it easy. You can ease yourself into intermittent fasting by fasting for 12 hours first during the first week or two, then start upping the hours you fast until you've hit your goal. With that out of the way, the big question that remains is if intermittent fasting is something that's worth incorporating into our lifestyles. Frankly, with all the studies conducted on intermittent fasting and all the benefits it provides, we can conclude that doing a bit of fasting every now and then wouldn't hurt, especially now that our generation is keen on overeating and consuming grease-filled and processed food. Subjecting our bodies to short-term stress can prove to be beneficial in improving our health in the long run. So, if you want a surefire way to lose weight, to improve your health, and to even look and feel like a celebrity, intermittent fasting is a promising way of achieving your health goals. But as always, we like to emphasize that before subjecting yourself to any lifestyle change or diet, it is important to seek advice from a licensed medical professional to ensure that this is something safe for you to do. And this wraps up today's video. Thanks for hanging out with us. And as always, if you learned a thing or two, show us some love by hitting that like button, click on the post notification button, and hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet so you won't miss any of our latest videos. Until next time, 